it's True Tech Cop here today, and today I'm going to be reviewing a program called Hashtab. Uh, this is for Windows and Mac. I'm doing it for Windows on here, obviously. And it's a free program that allows you to find the hashes of applications. For example, the CRC32 hash, the MD5 hash, and the SH1 hash. This is really useful when, for when you want to compare files, uh, so check if they're both the same file. And it's useful for using virus total as well. And I'm going to demonstrate to the virus total. So I'll put a link in the description, it's completely free. Uh, it's hosted on Google Sites here. So you just want to save it and uh, install it. So we go to the open folder. And then just go ahead and install it. Very basic. Let's go ahead and that's it. So now that you've installed it, you may not notice any icon on the screen yet. But now I'm going to demonstrate it with a piece of ransomware I've downloaded. It's uh, from some random website I've run on the malware domain list, a uh, list of malware uh, for malware researchers. So here I'm going to right click it and click properties. And I've already uploaded this to VirusTotal for this example. And I'm going to choose the file hashes. Now you should see there's a CRC32 hash, uh, MD5 and SH1, it even tells you what they are. You can compare files, for example if I compare the uh, hash of that folder, that file, it's not the same. So uh, I'm going to copy this, and I'm going to go to uh, the Virus Total website at virustotal.com. And then instead of uploading the file, we go to search. Then we right-click and click paste, and click search. And as we can see, it's been classed as malware, and that is how to use Hashtab. It's a really useful program. Uh, as you can see, you can use it to compare files to make sure you've got the right file. And that's basically it, so uh, thank you for watching.